She might notice my dog here. Oh hey there. Okay it's time run boys. Hey guys and welcome back to yet another new video. I've been thinking, should I leave the opening sentence out of my new videos from now on because you all pretty much know that there will be a new video every day right? Actually never mind I think it's pretty fun to do an opening sentence at the start of every video because that gives me some space to try and make a joke and although my jokes aren't that good there are some that are pretty decent. Anyway I thought it would be cool to play some murderer today because it's almost Halloween and you all know that I love Halloween so with that being said let's get started right away here. Well it looks like we are starting off as an innocent person here but that is totally cool. I wish I was the murderer a bit more often though because let's be honest here that is what makes this game so cool. It's being the murderer and secretly killing everyone when they least expect it. I mean I know how to do all of that because I was with the special forces in the army back in my day but I have told that story tons of times before so I'll save it for you this time. That's pretty nice from me right? Not telling you a whole story over again? Anyway it seems that the murderer still hasn't killed anyone so that either means that the murderer is really waiting for the right moment here or it could mean that he is not even present which would be fine with me because that would mean no killing and if you all know me I really like it when there is no killing at all it really makes me feel comfortable. Okay you know what never mind that whole no killing thing because there is a dead woman right there and I don't like this for one bit. Here's a pro tip for everyone that is watching this right now. Do not go and hide in the bathroom when playing murder mystery because chances are that the murderer will find you and if that happens you are kind of stuck in the bathroom unless you can somehow flush yourself into the toilet. In that case do hide in the bathroom because now that I think about it that is actually a really good tactic don't you guys think so? Like can you imagine what that would look like? Anyway if you didn't notice it yet, right now I am being chased by the murderer and I'll tell you what I'll play it easy the first round because I really have to get into the game again after such a long time. There is only one thing I have to do right now and that is to check if the sheriff has died and if he has in fact died I need to make sure I get his gun so that I will be ready whenever the murderer comes my way and oh boy let me tell you when he does get in my way I will pull the trigger but I can only do all of that cool stuff if I actually find the gun. Know what I'm saying? And seeing that there aren't that many people walking around here I am just going to assume that everyone has already been killed and that I am like the last survivor in here. But that is alright because that gives me a lot of space to walk and run in. And would you take a look at that? the gun from the sheriff. Alright now we are talking boys and girls. It's time to show this murderer who the real boss is in here. Now I just need this guy or girl. Wait I believe it was a girl. Anyway yeah I need this girl to come my way. Well would you take a look at that. I just totally nailed that shot and got the killer. I would say that that went pretty great for my first game. Or how the cool kids nowadays would say it. That was lit. I think that today is going to be a good day for murder mystery and I'm because winning that first game there really motivated me to do extra good today and that's why I know for a fact that I will almost win every single game today because as you all know, I am the best in this game and there are only a few who are better than me and those people are. Well actually I don't know who they are but I am sure they are around here somewhere. But let's not talk about people who are better than me because that wouldn't really make sense now would it? I'll tell you about something that does make sense and that is that I am going to win the next round too because in this lobby. I know I am the best of them all. But it looks like we're starting again here so let's get on with it. So it turns out we are in this office again and I have really noticed something weird. Like all of the office levels or maps I don't really care how you say it but they all look kind of the same. I mean don't they look the same to you guys? They for sure look kind of the same to me and I wonder how that can be. Maybe there is some huge secret to all of this that we all don't know about. I don't know I think it's pretty weird. Oh and yes. The murderer is chasing me again. I don't get it why does the murderer always have to chase me? Like why not go and chase someone else? Do you have any idea how many people are in this office right now? Also I bet that this guy has no idea what he is actually doing right now because by the looks of it he is very bad at being the murderer. I mean look at this I can literally stand next to him and he... Ouch. Okay look he got me but that one didn't really count okay? Good. So I kind of skipped the whole lobby thing again because I think that is only fun for when you actually win around and you dance around the whole lobby to show everyone that you've won and I hate seeing someone else doing the victory dance and so because I died I skipped the whole thing so that you guys don't have to see someone dance either know what I mean? I'm just thinking about all of you people right now and totally not about myself. Okay there might be a bit of sarcasm in that 
but hey don't mind me I am trying to hide from a murderer while you are just watching me hide from a murderer so I guess that I am in a bit more of a dangerous situation than you are right now. Oh look in there you have the murderer. Great. Alright look I have to run as fast as I can now because I really do not want to get caught here. That would be a huge shame for me because I just- Oh look at that he just did kill me. How cool is that? Let me tell you. It's not that cool at all. In fact, it is pretty bad. Now I am left here in the lobby again with all the people that died too. This makes me want to win even more because I hate it when I lose every time. Like I don't understand how the murderer got me though because let me tell you how fast I was running. I was as fast as this animal. In fact, it was as if I like was that animal. That's how it felt to me. But anyway. The next game is starting here so let me just play well here for once. Oh what a big surprise this is look everyone we are in the office map again but this time it's another map again and I can't believe it but there are like three versions of the office and I'm starting to believe that we will only be playing on the office levels today because I haven't seen another map yet and I have no clue how many games I have already played now but it's starting to annoy me right now. Also I bet you don't know this yet but watch this. I have this spot right here where the murderer will probably probably just walk past me without even knowing I'm here. The only thing I have to do in order for this to work is stand extremely still, which is super duper hard and I'm serious about that. But hey she did walk past me so I guess it kind of worked somehow. I mean she could be blind too who knows. That would actually be pretty stupid. A blind murderer like that wouldn't even make sense at all now would it how would she find any one of us unless she walked into someone she wouldn't really be able to murder anyone so I guess she's not blind at all I think I was just really good at the standing still part don't you guys agree okay so the only thing I have to do now is I have to make sure that I stay alive like I am right now because I really don't want to get caught again because that would so bad for my current reputation imagine me losing another game here I would be so disappointed in myself you wouldn't believe how disappointed I would be well I have to admit so far it's going pretty good and with pretty good I mean like really really good because she hasn't even seen me yet maybe if I just stand still here next to this closet she won't notice I am standing here pretty cool idea huh oh wait actually she might notice my dog here. Oh hey there. Okay it's time run boys because your boy sub is out. Okay she cheated. Alright everyone I have ran enough for today. This is a moment where things get super interesting because guess what? That's right. You guessed it right. Your boy sub the innocent man is now sub the brilliant and superb murderer coming to win another game here. You see becoming a good murderer takes a lot of time and I had the training that I needed to have in order to become a successful murderer. Know what I mean? Wait did I seriously got killed already? What was that all about that didn't even make any sense at all? I bet that everyone is really really cheating because let's be honest guys you saw it. That made no sense whatsoever. How could he have possible known? Well you what I don't care anymore. Because guess what? I am the murderer again here. I am going to play this round really differently from all the other rounds being a murderer because I believe that all the other murderers kind of do it wrong. You see the thing is you don't want to get noticed as a murderer and in my last game you pretty saw how not to play as a murderer and I admit that was kind of my own bad that the sheriff killed me so early on in the game but that is totally fine because this round I am going to be the best of the best and all of you will see that I am not joking around this time. The only downside to this game is this map because it's very big and I don't know if I'll have enough time to get everyone but I'm sure we'll find out soon enough here. Right now I just need to mentally prepare myself for the chaos and I have to think every move through before I execute my master plan here because I don't want anyone to see me and secondly when they do see me I don't want someone shooting me down right away like that last game so it would really fantastic if I could possibly kill the sheriff first because that would put me in a huge advantage do you know what I mean all of these people are really starting to get nervous though because I haven't made a move yet so here's what I am going to do I am going to take my position and wait for someone that walks by and is alone because if that person is alone no one will notice that person being gone know what I'm saying I think it's the perfect plan and it would be really cool if that one person would also happen to be the sheriff but enough talk it's about time we did something boom oh my gosh I am so super duper lucky Look at that, I got the sheriff right away. Okay that is super sweet because that means I can now go outside where pretty much most of the people are hiding anyways so this one is going to be really easy for me. I can wait to win this game because look at how good I am doing right now. The only thing that could possibly go wrong here is the time running out because of the whole time limit thing. 
which I think is way too low by the way but who I am to say anything about that. Oh that's right, I am Sub the Murderer that's who I am. And talking about being Sub-Zero the Murderer, I think I am doing pretty well so far. I mean look at all of these kills I am getting here it's so cool to see that after I've failed so many times I can still do good. I'm literally really proud of myself right now. Alright I have to start picking up the pace here though because my time is kind of running out here. It seems I only have about a minute worth of time left and that really sucks because I don't like it when I don't have a lot of time. Like a murderer should be able to carefully plan his attacks and all that stuff but nope that is not the case here. Okay so if I was hiding from myself, where would I be right now? Oh that's right, I would be outside asking for an autograph ha 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 see what I did there? I just made cool joke about myself. Okay that might not have been the best jokes or close to one of my best jokes but you have to admit that it was a pretty decent one. You know what just forget that joke, let's focus on the remaining survivors here that are really started to get nervous just like me because I think I am not going to find them because although I hate to say it, some of the okay I failed. Well at least I got really far right. Okay boys and girls and ladies and gentlemen and apples and tomatoes and basically all of you. It's time for the next round here. And I really wish that this wouldn't be the next map here but it looks we have to do it and if you all know me well you know I hate doing scary things and being in a dark mine shaft with a murderer following you is pretty scary. Oh the things I do for your entertainment. But hey. I guess it's almost Halloween and I guess that I should just go with it because it's almost Halloween right? Would you guys agree with that? Well it doesn't really matter if you do because here I am actually doing this. I don't get why I put myself in these situations sometimes but let's just get it on with here. I just hope that this round will be over very quickly because I would really enjoy a nice sunny map again instead of being down here trapped with a whole lot of people and knowing that one of them is a murderer who is about to kill all of us. Isn't that a lovely thought? I think it really isn't. And would you take a look at that? It seems that the murderer and the sheriff are actually having a fight. The sheriff is running for his life though. Oh geez Louise I am so happy that that is over right now because I really didn't like the whole mineshaft setting and all of you know that very well. I would much rather be on a very sunny island with a murderer than being down there with a murderer. I mean come on you know what I mean right? I can't really imagine someone being like oh yeah I love being down there in the mineshaft with a murderer chasing me and pretty much killing me with all my friends. Yeah that's great I would really love that. I really can't imagine someone thinking that but I guess there are just some people who find that very cool and intense and they should totally do that but it's not something for me I'll admit that. I just hope that the next game is a bit more peaceful. Either that or I hope to be the murderer. That would be pretty nice because I could end this video with me being the murderer for one more time. That would be really cool. That would end the video perfectly and it would be even cooler if I could win that round. Oh boy imagine that. But instead of talking about it let's actually do it. Okay so I have no clue why I am on the floor but I do know that your boy is innocent and not the murderer but that is fine. I guess I just think that being the murderer would be way cooler but unfortunately I can't decide what happens to me. Okay so let's play is really really cool here because we don't want trouble with the murderer now do we? I mean I guess we all already have a problem with the murderer oh wait no. I'm saying it wrong. Let me say that again. I think the murderer already has a problem with all of us because if he didn't I wonder why else he would try and murder every single on us. I don't know could be me too. Maybe he just has anger issues or something like that. Yeah that would kind of make of sense to me but I doubt if it's true. What I know for sure though is that I am going to try and survive for as long as I can this time. So in my opinion this girl right here is really creepy. I mean look at her she's just standing here not doing anything. It's really scary. It's like one of those things you only see in scary moves but here I am seeing it for myself. Wait maybe I am in a movie right now. A scary movie. Oh my that's a really weird thought right there. Okay enough talk about movies guys I need a good hiding spot but so far I'm not really seeing any good ones so if you have any suggestions please let me know because I think the murderer is actually on as his way and I know for a fact that when he comes my way he is going to get me but wait never mind that. I have the perfect spot here. Yeah this is good. So guys welcome back I just took a small break and here I am with a gun and you're probably wondering how I got that because I was innocent all this time. Well let me tell you how I got the gun. The murderer killed the sheriff so I made a run for it and now I have the gun and I can possibly shoot the murderer if he comes my way. This could still get really intense right here don't you guys think so? 
know for a fact that it can. It's just super hard to make the decision on who the actually murderer could be because there are a lot of possibilities you know. Like everyone could be it. The guy that currently is the murderer is doing a really good job of keeping it a secret and admit that. I just hope he does something wrong so I can find out that he's the one killing everyone. But it doesn't really matter because the time is almost up anyway. I don't get it how he could fail this one though because it's a pretty small place and it's really weird that he couldn't get everyone because I'd say there's time enough. Oh never mind it ended. Well at least we survived that guys. I was really hoping on surviving this last game so that I could prove to all of you that I can play good too. That being said, I hope to see all of you in the next video.